how to use concatenate function in Microsoft Excel. Hello everyone, welcome to Excel 10 tutorial. In this function explained video series, we are going to learn how to use concatenate function or you can say how to use concat function or you can say how to use ampersand in Microsoft Excel. All three does the same thing. Let's get started. <laughs> So the function concatenate, it actually joins text strings, okay? And we have only two arguments here. Number one, what we are going to join and number two, what we are going to join with, okay? So the best way to learn any function in Microsoft Excel is to apply one and we are going to apply the concatenate function here, okay? So write equal to then concatenate. And you can see this one concatenate and in the tool tips it says join several text strings into one text string this is why we use concatenate function to join several text string now if i open parenthesis here it has only two parameters the first one is text what you want to join and the second one is text also what you are going to join with okay so in the first parameter select the first cell and add a comma to go to the second parameter and select this one and you can continue this up to 255 times okay now if i close parenthesis and press enter you can see we just join the two cell into one okay so concatenate easily joins two cell into one and if i drag it you can see it has joined these two also now there are two more options to do the same thing so the next function is concat so this is concat and it actually the same function as concatenate and excel is introducing concat to the newer version and concatenate it still works but it want us to use the concat function instead so let's use it same thing concat select the first cell and select the second cell close parenthesis present now the same result and there is another option we can use ampersand to join two or several cells okay so we can use concatenate function and also we can use concat along with the ampersand let's do that here equal to our cell a1 ampersand b1 and if i press enter the same result so the concatenate function has been explained hope you understand the parameter hope you understand why we use it and if you like this video series function explained please let me know and i will explain a lot more function in this video series thank you thanks for watching see you in the next tutorial and if you can please support the channel through patreon thank you thanks for watching